Hello, Gulfport. I am Media, Ray Rodriguez, reporting from St. Pete Clearwater International Airport. Uh, this is where I park my car when I go to court in case they throw me in jail and they don't steal my car when I get out. And uh, uh, I've always loved the airports. My daddy was a pilot in the Air Force, brother-in-law, a whole bunch of family members. Uh, I flew a couple of jets in the Air Force, a T-37, and did some touch and goes in a tanker refueler, 141. Uh, and what we have are all these jet school people. Say hi to YouTube. Uh, that uh, they solo on their first day is what I understand. Uh, ATP, flight school, St. Petersburg. Uh, I always want to go back and get my license. Anyway, I'm going to court right now, my 11th bond revocation hearing. I parked my car here so that they won't steal my car. I don't take any papers into the courtroom because I've had them steal my briefcase at the x-ray machine and not allow me into the courthouse. And, and I'm not able to submit my evidence to the clerk of court. I have a couple of videos of that. I'm not able to submit my evidence in court. Uh, Judge Carballo, uh, I've had that. I've got that audio I'll be posting. And, and then I also can't get my evidence. I'm now on the two cases that I have my bond revocation hearing. It's for Chief Vincent arresting me for, uh, oh, uh, speaking at city council. And then his lying Debussy secretary that I just proved is a liar in stalking court last Tuesday. So the two cases that are open have now been open 17 months. And now Chief Vinson just arrested me for on February 2nd for uh, 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 um, trespass, criminal trespass from an unlawful trespass due to the lying to bitchy and then an unlawful arrest now. So I have now three arrests, two directly with Chief Vincent putting his hands on me. And why? He's the first one that's grabbing me. And why is he not listed as the arresting officer? He is a coward pushing off his bullshit, uh, cowardly ways upon anybody that will follow his stupidity. Now, uh, if Judge Carballo doesn't understand what Chief Vincent is doing, uh, because this all started when I start exposing criminals at the Boca Shega Yacht Club stealing from the residents. And then I've uncovered a bunch of crooked city elected and employees. And now I'm highlighting freedom in America. I love airports. I love uh, uh, everything to do with uh, uh, flying, sailing, adventure. Anyway, uh, I'm a free man today. Uh, if I do not, if I fail in this bond, the 11th, 10th and 11th bond revocation hearing, there is no more bond. I will be held in jail until trial. And I believe I still have my trial date set for the 29th of February. Uh, I am media. Freedom is difficult. Deal with it. This is the 56th court appearance I've come. And I've only missed one court appearance. It was due to... It was due to being beaten unconscious and kept four days naked in the jail and uh, concussion syndrome. And that was the stalking charge that I have a conviction on. I have one conviction due to missing a court case. I am media, Ray Rodriguez. This is freedom standing up against a fucking crooked system. It's the evil triad, police, courts, jail. Uh, Courts, police, jail, jail, police, courts. They all play the game and slap each other on the back and take my money. I'm a social security retire recipient. I receive $990 a month. I have no money. I just had to borrow. Oh, I just had to borrow from a family member so I could get gas and parking uh, today. My social security check comes in tomorrow. And I'll have another $1,000 to stand up against tyranny and fight criminals, law enforcement, Chief Vincent. You cannot press charges against police officers. Uh, I'm going to park my car. I'm going to walk about a half mile to the uh, courthouse. And then I'll go through the goon process of the sheriffs following me, harassing me, 
You can't stand up to tyranny unless you get 